So just off the top of your head, do you know what GIS stands for? No. <laughs> I have no, maybe students? S? So there's some econ classes that actually use GIS, and I know it's like you analyze data with it, like large amounts of data with it. Yeah. Do you want to guess what the acronym is? Geographic Independent Society. <laughs> Close. So, um... Global Interactive System. So GIS stands for Geographic Information System. Oh, cool. Do you want to guess what it does? Something with data collection? Question mark? I bet you it tells you information based off geography. Okay, that, that was a great answer, Thank yeah. You. It's used to analyze a large amount of data. Geographic, I'm assuming, like, stuff around the world, stuff in other countries, stuff in other continents. So geographic information system refers to the way that we collect geographical data for different tools. How often do you think you use it? I think I use it every day because I'm on Find My iPhone a lot, or, like, Find My Friends, and so I try it. Probably use it all the time because I use my maps a little amount of the time. On the CarPlay, of course, there's, like, a map always. Oh, probably every day. Good answer. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> apps like Find My, Snap Maps, even dating apps like Tender Hinge, food delivery apps like Uber Eats, they all use geographic information systems. So you're constantly using GIS even if you don't know it. So how did you do on these questions? Follow us if you want to learn more about GIS.